see you safe. We've got to go ahead. If you're on edge, I should alert the entire Inquisition. Or increase my hazard pay. That's an option. <laughs> Are things that bad? Oh. Crestwood was the site of a flood ten years ago during the Blight. It's not the only rift in the area, but after it appeared, corpses started walking out of the lake. You'll have to fight through them to get to the cave where Sir Hawk's Grey Warden friend is hiding. Have any undead attacked the camp? We've had a few shamblers, but most head toward the village below. Maybe someone in Crestwood can tell you how to get to the rift in the lake. Maker knows they'll want help. Good luck, and please be safe. a way to get to the rift in the lake yes preferably without drowning it sounds different the water changes the song the great wardens thank you for your aid inquisitor what are you doing in crestwood hunting one of our own we have orders to capture sir alistair of ferelden on site the man's slippery as an eel we've been chasing him for weeks what have you been told about this rogue ward? Warden Commander Clarell ordered his capture. I can say no more than that. I hope Alistair comes quietly. I'll not fight the man who helped kill that many Darkspawn. Will you stay to fight the undead here? My orders forbid it. Crestwood was only a detour. The Inquisition can help. Beg you to do what you can. The villagers have only lost too many. Help. Sure, we can't help the village. Our orders are clear. If we can't find Warden Alistair, we can return to the command. They leave me. They're amazing. I'm going to see if they're looking for recruits. to join the Grey Wardens now. Oh, Maker. You're the Inquisitor. Um, but yes. The Wardens are heroes. They saved me from those demons, Your Worship. With all that's happening, I'd like to help people the same way. <laughs> By joining the Grey Wardens. You can't think of something less lethal. Find another way to help people. The wardens have problems of now. Yes. Do to help. Fair, I'll avoid the wardens in turn. Thank you, the warden. I understand the lake has been a source of local myths for centuries. Honorous Inquisitor, I am Sister Vaughan. Does the Mayor finally plan to drain the lake? I must find someone to retrieve the remains of those lost there. Have I interrupted a funeral service? We lost many friends in the first attack. <laughs> there will be endless time to mourn. The fear is how many more will be added to the pyre. What 
did you mean by finally drain the lake? The undead returned only after the light in the lake. We want to stop them. We must investigate. But the mayor sent no one at all. I fear he thinks that emptying the waters would unleash even more monsters on us. You want to exhume the corpses at the bottom of the lake? They were the Maker's children. Their earthly bodies deserve better than abandonment in a mire. A funeral service will help put living minds at ease. Your devotion does you credit, sister. Seek a Pentecost. Forgive me, I did not expect to see the right hand of the Divine in our humble village. Be at ease. We have too much to do to stand on rank. Yes, Seeker, as you say. Until later. Andraste guide you. You picked a fine time to visit, friend. The dead are walking the night. We used to have plenty. I can count on one hand the number we've gotten since the trouble started. Harvest will be full. It's not safe to work the fields. Best be on your way. It's not safe here. Why doesn't Judith live in the village while this is going on? Make her, if something happens. Are you looking for someone named Judith? Oh, was I speaking out loud? Judith lives outside the village. I asked her to hide here when the undead came, but she wouldn't hear it. Why wouldn't she hide where it's safer? Likes her space, she says. I told Judith my house was big enough. Me and the boy could sleep in the barn if she wanted room. She turned me down. Good day to you, and to you. I'll come out when it's safe. Who is that, anyway? Maker, it's the end of the world. I'll come out when it's safe. Who is that, anyway? Mayor Dedrick of Crestwood Village, at your service, despite everything. Are you here to stop the undead? We should. We could. Everyone here is so scared. The undead are appearing because of a rift in the Fade. How can I get to it? The light in the lake? It's coming from the caves below old Crestwood. Darkspawn flooded it ten years ago during the Blight. Wiped out the village, killing the refugees we took in. I saw a dam. If we use it to drain the lake, I can get to that Fade Rift. Drain the... There must be some other way. We are trying to help. The Inquisitor is the only one who can close the rift. You'd have to evict the bandits in the old fort to use the dam. I can't ask you to risk your life. You're risking the village's safety if you spurn my help. Or is someone else coming? But... No, they aren't. This key unlocks the gate to the dam controls past the fort. The rift must be in the caves under old Crestwood. But, Inquisitor... I would not linger there. Tell me about your village. It's seen happier days. We farm what we can, trade with the merchants who travel the King's Road. We only want peace, Your Worship. It's all we've ever wanted. What can you tell me about the bandits camped in the fort? The highwaymen? Thugs and thieves! They make a living raiding caravans on the King's Road. When the dead rose from the lake, 
The bandits killed the old gamekeeper and the fort and took it for themselves. We could have saved people if we'd been able to hide there instead of in our homes. I'm surprised a town as small as Crestwood outlasted the blight. It was a close thing. The Darkspawn followed a band of refugees running from the blight. Some of the refugees were... They were very ill. But we took them in. They perished when the Darkspawn flooded old Crestwood. How did Darkspawn manage that? They found the dam's controls. Wrecked them. All I remember is the refugees and villagers screaming as they drowned. And now... They return to us. Until later. Of course. Unnatural things walk in the night. It's the Maker punishing a sinful world. That's what I say. Dead! I think that's all of them. This place would be an asset to our agents if you claimed it. We could throw the Inquisition's banner over the battlements. The villagers may not even object. Another stronghold for the Inquisition. What now? We should drain the lake. The mayor said the dam controls were through the fort. Welcome, Inquisitor. My name is Charter. Leleana's eyes and ears, especially in this place. I'll have some information for you once my man Butcher finds us. He's running late. Nightingale will tell you why she wanted agents here. We lie on the main road between Denerim and Val Royale. Couriers stop here all night. For what they're paid, some have surprisingly loose tongues. When's this spy named Butcher supposed to arrive? Half hour ago, by the same I hope he's only delayed. Butcher's last message swore he had secrets for us worth times his weight in gold. What's happening in Crestwood? The roads are nearly deserted. Too many undead keep rising from the lake. What's happening in Crestwood? The roads are nearly deserted. Too many undead keep rising from the lake. I should be going. after an assignment. Don't worry. I'm not throwing you out for a round of wicked grace. The thought never crossed my mind, Your Worship. No, surely not. Quiet, you. Come on, Cooper. Join us for a spell. Not likely. Someone needs to deal with the last of Crestwood's highwaymen. Who has time? If we clear the bandits out, more travelers. More travelers. More news for the Nightingale. Good point, but I've got a code to unscramble if you want to know who killed Comte Bayeux last week. Are the highwaymen still in Crestwood? Yes, Your Worship. Now that their fort is gone, the bandits are ambushing travelers. Crestwood won't stop them either. The town's still reeling from the undead. Red Templars are here. The Fade sings around them. All red. Be careful. Cassandra, 
Who's Regalian? No one to concern yourself with. You were thinking about the time you... Now I'm thinking about something else. Can you guess? My hat wouldn't fit there. Reinforcements! To think they swore themselves to the Maker's Servant. It is a bad time to come knocking. Between the corpses and the wyvern, nothing here is safe. But I wouldn't give to get my hands on that animal. There's a wyvern causing trouble. It used to hunt in the mountains. Didn't bother anyone but the bandits. <laughs> Lately, the bee's got it in his head to come down here. It almost crippled Gaul's little boy. Best someone kill it. I hope I get my hands on the liver. It makes a poison that kills rats like nothing. I killed the wyvern up in the cave. The body's yours if you want it. That I do. Here, for your troubles. I hope you can make good use of it. A fine day to you. Do you farm out here? The name's Judith. I farm and I mend things for the village and people passing through. I did a fair trade with traveling merchants before the undead started attacking. Not to mention that dragon. But you still like living here. Rooting where you dig. Your land and no one else's this time. Well, that's... <laughs> Aren't you a sharp-eyed one? What do you know about the dragon? She moved in a month ago. The guards tried to run her off, but she snapped one's head off and she flew away. Poor Hamald. At least it was quick. Since then, she's eaten three horses, five goats, and two cats. If you're Judith, there's a man in the village concerned about you. <laughs> that must be Gould. Fretful as ever. I'm glad he stayed in Crestwood. He's fast as you please with a loom, but terrible with a sword. Until later. Be safe. I, I've never been seen. Why would you? They do not exist in Tevinta. What are they? Some man of Super Templar? Is this one of those southern secrets like proper hygiene? Once we worked from the shadows, monitoring Templars and mages alike. Ah, that clearly worked out well. Your glibness does you no credit. The mage rebellion was beyond even our power to control. <laughs> what in? <gasps> Don't mind us, just passing by. The Inquisitor? We didn't know you were here, sir. Please don't tell anyone. How did you get past the guards? There weren't any when we got here. We just heard you killed the bandits, Your Worship. We didn't know you were moving in, we promise. You won't tell people we were here, will you? I see you couldn't resist the thrill of a decrepit pub. There's nowhere else, sir. Everyone is crammed into the village. Lonnie's parents would have a fit if they saw us. Oh, we'll have to wait an hour to go back. Your father will still be up. I knew this was a mistake. We could try the caves. You hate spiders. You find somewhere next time. The said Darkspawn destroyed the controls ten years ago. Who repaired them? The mayor. His shame had this shape. Oh look, a dragon. What a perfect way to ruin our day. Come on, let's find that fate ring. It's humming below us. A window, wanting, wandering, looking back at what's looking. Our resident expert seems to think we're on the right path.
There's dwarven ruins down here. The whole area is still lit up. Demons ahead. They don't understand it here. They want to destroy everything. The dead will finally rest easy in Crestwood. Let's tell the men. They were hurting and we helped. Their lives are better because of us. Where are we going? I feel a draft. There must be a way out nearby. Yes. The rage demon in the caves is dead, as you commanded. I had no doubts. Now that my sovereignty has been respected, I can depart this unchanging nightmare. Your reward. Use it well. Gift Inquisitor. If only all the spirits were this easy to get rid of. Oh, make I hear my cry. Your worship. I've already found the remains of the people who died in Old Presswood. That's it, I'm trusty. I didn't imagine you'd look yourself. Thank you for your thoughtfulness. It is all too rare these days. I will prepare the bodies for cremation. What do you mean the mayor's gone? A letter of confession from the mayor. It says he was the one who flooded old Crestwood ten years ago. To stop the blight from spreading. It's monstrous. But if it stopped the blight from wiping out the entire village... What a sad mess. Will the Inquisition bring him in? Classically arousing in every sense. Careful. He is. Of course. Cresswood has had no further trouble with the undead. After what happened, it will take time for the village to recover. All right. Mayor Gregory Dedrick of Crestwood is present for betraying his own constituents. He confesses that, ten years ago, he flooded old Crestwood to kill refugees and villagers touched by the blight. The mayor claims it was to spare the rest of Crestwood, but we only have his word. He's pleading guilty while claiming he's not. Which is it? There's no cure for the blight. But I couldn't convince anyone to leave a sick child or husband behind. So you herded the infected into one place and flooded old Crestwood? Were no innocents caught in the waters? Nearly everyone in the village had the blight. I swear it. Have mercy. I couldn't tell the survivors I'd drowned their own families to save them. I, I, I couldn't. You committed murder on Ferelden's soil. Let them deal with your punishment. Send him to Denerim. He can live the rest of his life behind their bars. In prison? Maker. I should have drowned with them. <laughs>